So, Jason, I'd like to welcome you to the show. Oh, thank you. Yes. So, Jason, wow. Like, what, what, uh, I just got done, like I just was just saying about watched it twice already. Jason, <laughs> how the hell <laughs> do you uh, even build a following to say, hi, I'm going to make a fan film and get all these all star cast people from uh, all these Friday the 13th films we know? I mean, yeah, Tom Matthews, Richie Ramone, Rob Mello. You had the great Darcy DeMoss. You had Tamara Glim, C.J. Graham, and you even had the director of Friday the 13th, Part 6. So you're directing him. <laughs> yeah. And Diana Prince, Darcy the Male Girl from Joe Bob. Yeah. Your list goes on and on. It goes on. It's great. So how, how did – just kind of curious, how does this all even start? I mean, how do you build a following – for something that's a, a fan film, not really part of the franchise, but it might as well be the, the way you're putting this production value in. Well, I mean, it started years and years and years ago when we uh, did uh, Vengeance. So you know, we started with a small film called Mythos. Didn't work out, so we expanded it into Vengeance, um, directed by Jeremy Brown. He put that together, brought me on as Jason. Um, and we knew that we needed to build an audience, and so we brought on Peter Anthony, who is uh, great at marketing and getting words out there and, and connecting with people. So he helped grow our audience as well. Um, so we can get the fans that kind of help and support and back it. And, um, and from that point, uh, Jeremy and I, um, we talked about bringing CJ Graham on to play Elias Voorhees, um, expanding the story. And so Jeremy reached out to him. Uh, he was on board. Then we reached out to Steve Dash, um, who played Jason in part two, uh, to be our sheriff. And that's how we, we got our first film together. Um, worked with Tom McLaughlin a lot because we wanted to open that film with um, the Elias story. And originally part six, the ending was supposed to have Elias in the graveyard. So we worked with Tom and we got the, the cut ending from part six. We made our opening for Vengeance. Um, and being it was a sequel to part six, we thought that was really great. So um, that's where we started there. And then with the success of Vengeance one, um, you know, there's a lot more people that were uh, that were willing and able and excited to jump onto part two. They wanted to have a cameo or a part in that. So um, in my little tours, going to conventions and doing signings, I got to meet a lot of amazing people like Paul Taylor and, and Tam, uh, Tamara Glenn uh, and all that. And um, and originally, Felissa Rose was supposed to be in it. Um, but and uh, David Howard Thornton, who was playing Art the Clown, but they both had schedule conflicts. So we had to do some rearranging. Peter said, hey, let's reach out to Darcy DeMoss. Um, he was in contact with her. And I was like, but didn't she die? And he's like, but did you see her? It's like, all right, fair. So we reached out to her. She was on board. 